On Thursday, polling at Nawai Block was disrupted by people claiming to be community leaders. They demanded the suspension of polling. Polling officials were confronted by scrutineers and leaders who said the ballot papers were not enough. The officials suspended polling at 9.30 a.m. that morning but were advised to remain on site. Morabe election manager Simon Saheke said today that polling will not be conducted for the ward. So I believe we have given them ample time to cast their vote, which uh, they have not, have not done. So uh, the decision now is we, we uh, from our end, we, we might not poll as, as it is so. Joe Are, a resident who has voted in three elections, is disappointed. He says polling should have been allowed to continue. Uh, voting should go ahead and come up here because government give one blood data so long to make him leader of the lion. Time only dispute him here and my victim is that. Grace Laman, a woman's representative and scrutineer who was there, said the community wanted to vote, but polling was disrupted by a few people. Do you think we will just make this election or some fail election? Yes, me plus some eligible voters, me plus staff, and me plus no being vote. So Heke said if polling is allowed, the precedent he would set would possibly pay void for future elections to be disrupted in the same way. These concerns were considered, including the legal implications that could affect the conduct of elections. Lucy Kopana, National MTV News, Lake.